Did you know, according to Luke 2.52, that Jesus increased in favor with God? He increased in favor with man. And that means that we can increase the favor and the grace on our lives. I want to challenge you that if you've never tithed before, start tithing to your local church. It is a phenomenal way to have the windows of heaven open. When you give tithe, when you pay your 10% of gross, you are giving God your faith. Tithing is the way for recession or depression to bypass you. You can't have this. I have a covenant blessing with the Lord. Prove me, God said, touch me and see if I won't. Now, just like we discussed earlier, the tithe is the blessing connection. I've accumulated a lot of credit card debt over the past three years, not to mention my student loans. I tithe faithfully, but now I'm thinking about suspending my tithing to pay off the credit card debt faster. Uh, make sure that you paid down some of those cards, but don't stop your tithe. Big mistake. I tell you what, I tithe before I eat. And if you'll do this, he said, I will pour out so much blessing on you. I love the fact that God didn't say, I would fill your cup. God said, I will pour out so much blessing on you that you will not have room enough for it. Our God says, my bucket is bigger than your bucket, and you can't even handle the blessing I want to pour out on your life. Because I'm the one that gives you the ability to get wealth. I give you 100% and only ask for 10% back. Don't you think that I've got sucker instead of you? And then I'm going to take your 10% and protect your 90%. And then if you're so in a tide of an offering, I'm going to give you 30, 60, 100 fold over that. I think that's a good deal. This is a promise to the tither. This is the I will. These are the things that God said he will do. If you will, God will. But the part of the blessing is when I bring my tithe, Honey, something might jump on me, but it's got to get off me. And when I tithe, he said he'll rebuke the devourer. It might be coming my way, but he'll say, stop, no more. You can't touch this. This is a tither. This is a tither. This is a tither. They don't have lack. This is a tither. They don't die camps. This is a tither. They don't get divorced. This is a tither. They don't beat up on each other. I'm telling you, man, this stuff works. And most guys are not man enough to step up and fight the war on wealth. You'll waste your energy watching some game. You'll waste your energy on some hunting trip. You'll waste your energy watching UFC or lifting weights or whatever. It's time to leave. Your woman wants you to leave. Stand up and be a man and bring the tide and see how God blesses you.